recording here. So, like I was saying, I made a couple modifications to the list. I went to a third blast zone down to two ways. I cut the basilisk collar. I added an Ulamog, the infinite gyre here. Um, for anyone that's not familiar with the list, though, I'll run through it real quick. We're on triple blast zone, one caverns, quadruple uh, temples, two ghost quarters, four of each of the trilands, two ways, four maps, two dismembers, uh, four matter reshapers, four thought knots, four congregate creator, four reality smashers, one sky sovereign, one Ulamog infinite gyre, two inbringers, one Ugin the ineffable, uh, two all is thus. We've got four chalices and three ballistas. So over the sideboard here, uh, obviously we've made a concession to Hogak. We've got four ley lines. Uh, if we don't get those, we're not casting those, so we better get those. <laughs> Is your thoughts playing Urborg doing? Uh, possibly. You know, reasonably, uh, you know what? That doesn't sound bad played as a one of. But what would we cut? Let me see your lanes. We'd have to either cut Blast Zone or a Ghost Quarter. I think Caverns is really strong. Could just cut Cavern. That's good in the... Oh, we there's have a lot ghost of quarters. There's a blue level. Yeah, we can cut one. We can cut one ghost quarter. All right. We'll try right. it. Modifying it on the fly right now. The Gorby wants us to play one Urborg. I am in on this. Try it out so it's not completely dead, I guess. No, don't do it, Urborg, do it. Just do another Cavern. <laughs> another Cavern? For the control matchup. I'm actually okay with trying out an Urborg. I'm not I was kind of joking, but... I'm No, I'm honestly curious. It does allow us to cast the ley line of the void. I would say it would be bad if we couldn't search it up, but we can yeah, we can, we can search, search it up. up so. well, it's going to be terrible. And I love me some Urborg. <laughs> if we're playing Urborg... No. We might as well play a blue <laughs> obliterator, right? Of course. If we're playing obliterator, we gotta play like Gary. <laughs> you know what you also need if you're playing Gerborg? What's that? You need some Fraxine Arena. Mm. Get that card advantage engine. Do I think we're playing the wrong deck at this point? I'm not listening to you guys on deck building. <laughs> what what bad decks have I ever built? So many. Fairy ninjas were hot! You heard him right, folks. Fairy ninjas. They were sweet. Did Jitsu those spell starter sprites? <sighs> Blake, if I, you said you were in if I ever built that. I will try it. Like, We actually might be... Uh, the more reasonable thing might be just to play four Ravenous Traps, but Ravenous Trap is like a soft answer to... Um, to them, and that, but it might be better because it's better against other matchups, but I don't know. I think Ravenous Trap would be better. Because I definitely drew it once. You're just talking. So. I love Ravenous Trap. Let's try it out. I'm, I'm totally cool with trying out different variations. Alright, the Stream Decker should be updated at this point. Let's run into a league. The deck is selected. So with this new, like reward system I haven't lost money but I haven't like gained money with like the amount that I've win been winning either like I'm still at that deficit from all those standard leagues I was playing and lost a bunch of money on so <laughs> when you just jam decks just to jam decks and see what you like you lose, I mean you lose money. we're play testing so if we're not losing money that's pretty much a win-win like, right? yeah right now But I also feel like I probably would have gained money a while back if it was the oldest structure. All right, turn three, Tron. We're good to this game. We're not on the play. Wouldn't it be better just to play uh, Matter Reshaper turn two? No. Okay. <laughs> Don't talk nonsense. So, like... Uh, if I guess if this is like a creature matchup, maybe. But like, even if this was a creature matchup, right? Like, you're still generally better off going Thought Knot into Matter Reshaper turn three sure. over doing Matter Reshaper turn two into Thought Knot. Like, sure. I don't know. There, there's possibly a line where that would be the case. But then, like, if it's a creature matchup, then Ballista's also online. 
Gotcha. Okay. So, this is affinity, so we definitely uh, want to. It might not be. It might, might be, not be. It's either affinity it or work. Be it looks like work. Yeah. Oh! No, you it's know what this is? Work. It's the uh, Urza deck. They use Core Tapper. Interesting. What? Interesting. Core Tapper. They use Astral Cornucopia, yeah. Core Tapper. Uh, what's the other thing that adds charge counters? I'll pretend I know what these are. Okay. So the question is here is we probably got to rip apart their hand pretty quick here. Um, whether or not Temple's worth it. Just I think you just got to go for the Tron. The only way Temple play, pays off is if we draw exactly Temple next turn. I know. I think that's a little too risky. Well, like, the alternative is that we're not casting Thought Not till turn 3, but if we go Temple into Power Plant into Tower, we're still casting Thought Not turn 3. Yeah, but we're not casting the Matter Shaper either. Right, but that shouldn't matter in this matchup. Maybe putting pressure on him doesn't matter? No, no, like, the casting it next turn is going to be more or less the same. Is what I'm saying. Okay. But, we'll go this line. Like, the, the, what I'm saying is the, the, the small chance of having it turn two is possibly worth the risk of us being delayed on a three power attacker on turn three. I mean, Andrew said the same thing and you said no, that was stupid. Until it was this deck. Oh. Until it was this deck. Because now getting the turn. No, he was talking about Matter Reshaper turn two. I'm talking about. Right, Thought. which would be playing the Eldrazi Temple turn one. Right. Well, so, like, my point here is that it, in mm. the case where you need to rip their hand apart, um, that's why it's relevant. If it's just the creature, usually you're okay with waiting an extra turn because then you're just playing Fault Not a Matter of Shaper anyway. Mm -hmm. So it, it, they're two different uh, lines of thought. Okay. Playing E for zero or one? Yeah, he just wants some dudes, I guess. So the second Ballista's is really Because we, the next turn, we're just going to be casting a Walking Ballista on... No, we can't. No, kill really size size of four. So we just gotta play Thought Not Matter Shaper and then the next turn kill Psy. Yeah. He could play if he's got the Urza right now. He is Psy more like more really likely. that big a deal here? Yes. They have two cards in hand. So with mm -hmm. do you know what the new Urza does play? Yeah. So every like how, how do what's their draw engine? Urza, what the what you have to sack the creatures, right? No. No, no Urza's the draw. No, Urza tap, lets any artifact tap for blue mana. Yeah. Including those doctors. Okay. What is, how do they draw the card, draw cards? They play, they, the... Urza's, Urza's ability. <laughs> Urza's effect lets you play off the top of the deck by paying mana. Oh, okay. Too. That's so unfortunate. So we just gotta play the thought knot and the matter shaper. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it was a simian spirit. time at this point. Yeah. I think he's he's side draw cards. Yep. God, hers is so good. Oh, yep. Okay. So what does Draining Station do? Sacrifice an artifact, mm -hmm. and then target uh, player puts top three into their graveyard. Yeah, whenever an artifact enters the battlefield, you may untap it. Oh, okay. Yeah. There's an infinite mill combo. It's not do? milling themselves? Yeah. 
He's trying to find the sword. Mm-hmm. Well, he doesn't have the artificer. Finding the sword in the grave it doesn't matter if you don't have the <clears throat> other common when you're Psy Master Thopters to build. Psy still creates one of ones for you. Oh, Echo of Eons. Ha! Baller. Not good for us, but baller for them. It's kind of cool. I too would like to draw seven cards. <laughs> that's what the, so that's what the deck's trying to do. Echo of Eons. And they can just sack the... <clears throat> what an interesting deck. You know, it stops this. Carton. Part of this. They can still do a lot of stuff without it. Because Urza's effect of size doesn't care about. Well, to be fair, if we draw Karn, we can play Karn into. Oh no, we can't. We go away. No, no, we go we get into Karn. Oh, yeah. Well, I'll say we have enough to play the uh, <sighs> Michael and Flat. I suppose we'd be one mana short because mm. we don't have a tower. If we get a turn, we're definitely going to Chalice on zero, I'm pretty sure. That seems reasonable. Or it's Chalice on two for the kind of Doctor. What did he just do? <laughs> echo the he just activated the, and they got an echo off the top. The same. So now we're much worse. We are much worse. We needed that ballista. We just attack with the air block with the. Yeah. We need to hit either Ugin or Ballista. <sighs> Ballista. We're good at this game. Ballista for four kill Urza? No. Kill the... The, uh... What? Psy. You sure? Psy's creating the chain with the... That can only keep going because of the Urza, mm -hmm. right? I suppose so. I mean, it, either one. I mean, they do have seven cards in hand. Likelihood that they have both in hand. Pretty high, I feel like. I think... Well, I'm, I'm going to be doing it with the boat partially, by the way. I'm going to go boat, shoot one, ballista for two. I mean, shoot one and then run out the map. Yes, I like taking the Urza down. Because that's their enabler. Yeah, I feel like Urza being one of the combo pieces is kind of a big deal. Sure. Like, Urza gives them the mana... To dig for another. <laughs> That's funny. It comes up to him because you play a boat. <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's so funny. What'd they say? He's just tapping for mana. Attack. I'm afraid of this, the guy just getting massive. Yeah. You can just animate the boat and just block. Not if I attack. No, I know, I know. It attacks. Yeah. And uh, the boat only triggers when it attacks, right? Yeah. Uh, and it was like, I didn't think it was a looter scooter. Yeah, another one. Yeah. cast an artifact, you can draw a card. If you do, you discard a card. It's an artifact looter. So it's pretty good. 
opponent is on the Urza combo deck. So this is some pretty spicy stuff. It's my first time going against this, so I'm really interested in seeing how this plays out. They've cast Echo Vions like four times already. We did get a Karn, though. What did that do for us here, stopping them wise? Can we... No. We can't grab the Lattice and play Lattice. No, because our board's not good enough. They've got two massive creatures. It's fair. How big are the uh, part of the Karn struck? Uh, they're 8-8s eight currently. So we can use the Karn to fetch out a... a um, and Staring Bridge. And Staring Bridge. Yeah. They might just echo VNs again, though. That's what I'm not really worried about what's in our hand until. They definitely have the mana for it right now. This is such a cool deck. I really wanted that Chalice on Zero. <laughs> minutes. Holy cow. We're at 22. There's another Eon. Oh, I know. This is the lawn a little bit ago. And they definitely have one in the graveyard. You would think. Oh, I, def I saw it in the graveyard. Mm -hmm. They only have one XL? Yeah. Because <laughs> they cast the other one. This deck is sweet. Is there is still ridiculous? Yeah. Nice. Yeah, it's like uh, I believe it's like thirty bucks. That's not bad. No, not at all. It's like the most expensive card in the set. Is it now? Oh yeah, because Hogak dropped. Uh, Urza is a forty dollar card. Yeah, Echo of Eons is a fifteen dollar card. Wizard Tribal do. Hmm? Wolf, Wizard, Trap. Oh, those are other decks, man. Are you saying you want to check away from this? Figure out what's, what's what's going on in your life? I'm really interested in Wolf, Wizard, Tribal. Run in 6 is $50, so that's the most expensive card in this deck. So, so confused by this deck. <laughs> what did you do? Oh, he just won. Bye. Ah, uh, because he's got enough in his graveyard to kill him. Oh, <laughs> that's at the beginning of the end step. Oh my gosh, that's so cool! That's cool, man. Oh my gosh, we're gonna lay land the void him. <laughs> <laughs> uh, do we need anything I else? That, yeah, that's pretty much it. Mm, do we want the Trinus here in the here in the side? Side, side, because remember he's gonna try to echo the on us. I don't need this boat. We don't need the all of us. <laughs> we don't need the all of us. I, I mean, think I need the Ugin either. Ugin's, I guess, removal. Endbringers are pretty good. Endbringers don't seem great. I feel like I might want... I like keeping one all his dust, because it kills both Psy and Urza. Do we have any Warping Whales? No Warping Whales. Oh, we don't need Ulamog. Yeah, we do. They can mill us. They don't mill us. If you have a Layla under the way to play, they will attempt to mill you. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Take out a Smasher. I just feel like... We should have at least one all's dust for the. Yeah, we can still leave one all's dust. Yeah, it clears both the creatures. Like we're just bringing this in. Yeah. So. Yep. Reasonable. This deck is sweet. They got going on. I'm kind of jealous. It's cooler than our deck. That's mean. I like our deck. We even got a ley line. Pretty reasonable. And we can cast it. Uh, we actually checked this. You do not cast Ley Lines. No, we could cast it. <laughs> <laughs> but we did check. 
Yeah, you just, you just put in play. For like force of will negations? Yeah. Yeah, you just put in play. Yeah, that was unfortunate. Yeah, you may begin the game with it on the battlefield. Yeah, we just had to read it real quick. Reading the card explains the card. RTFC. <clears throat> That's gonna be a grind. Can they beat a ley line? I'm sure they can. We would love a chalice on zero. Uh, oh my god. So they have access to three mana next turn? Whatever. <laughs> Our deck's always boring. It's just Tron. Just Tron? We do different variations. Do we? Yeah. I play other decks because I get bored of other decks. Have you played the artifact with it? That was yeah. Before? so hard to see with being this far away from the screen. Like, you guys know there's other chairs, right? I know. But look at he likes to lounge out. I'm giving you ample space to see the screen, unlike you who's like... You guys know this could be... <laughs> oh, well, there we go, much better. Thank you, Dewey. That seems pretty good. Oh no, we can't have zero cards that game. No. Shoot. <laughs> oh, Burkle's recall? I think we just take the garage. Hi. What are we worried about them blowing up? Right? That's card in their hand. Is it though? Uh, it has the most utility. Uh, looter doesn't? I feel like the looter would. What do we have? Jake? Digs him to more. Who took the grudge? Cool. Yeah. He's got another looter. Yeah. <gasps> Are we taking the other Hercules now? Technically, Hercules recall. No. Yes, and reset himself. Well, he like, lets him loot again. He's also, he's oh, wait, no, he's got a little artifact there. Yeah. Whew. He's bad. Doesn't seem great. Oh, I. Okay, there it goes. No, I guess he can double block if he wants. They're two ones. Siege. Every time he casts a uh, artifact spell, he gets a 1 1 mirror. And that's what he chose. So good. No, you get both modes. No, you don't. No, you don't. Absolutely not. It's just like the old dragon. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh, oh, okay. The dragon in cons? Yeah. Those were, that was a fun cycle. I'm 
this ghost core ring their dire. I mean, it's helping us loot to better stuff too. Yeah, but we have a game winning board state already. I'd rather just kill them. Reasonable. So they're in this position. <laughs> I like a blast zone on three right here. I like a ballista on lethal. That's fair. Ballista shoot down both their blockers. Correct. Actually, it's just ballista shoot down the Riddle Smith, but <laughs> <laughs> we got him, folks. Lay line doing work. Did it actually that game though? Yeah. yeah. Was it play? <laughs> Did it though? Was it play? They didn't have Sai or Urza. They didn't have the thing that was milling them. They also couldn't aggressively mill, uh, loot themselves. Right. Right. I said it. Yeah. They, they also they didn't have the thing that mills them. No, they they had the real smith to aggressively loot if they wanted to. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they were declining to keep their interaction in hand. Uh, that interaction in the form of Simeon Spear Gang? Uh, no, it was the interaction of Ancient Grudge. Thanks Universal for the Spirit. follow, Minion of Pain. Much appreciated, man. I guess... No, man. I don't know if you're a man or not. You're, you're, you could be a zombie running across my string, uh, screen right now. We got another ley line. Yes. Seems reasonable. And got a temple. And Dewey, you are so good at this game. Professional effect. Are you though? I'm getting paid to play Magic right now. I just want to point that out. <laughs> are you though? Yeah. You told me you couldn't figure out how to work that system. I don't know where the money's at. <laughs> <laughs> I'm but simply, it's there. <laughs> I'm simply pointing out. I'm really super sad. Like I can't run out this map. I mean, sure. Why not? It's gonna blow it up with the, the EE. Darn. I've gotten paychecks, man, from SCG. I think that makes me an actual amateur. I have too. Oh, so amateur, not professional. Amateur professional. <laughs> We're bending so many, so many rules. Am I? Am I? I feel like we are. I don't think I'm allowed to accept donations yet. Uh, I think you can subscribe, though, if you'd like. Because I have to reach a certain amount of subscribers before uh, I'm allowed to do that. I am more than happy to take a one month donation for you to prove both of these guys wrong. I never that said that makes my day. Dewey, well, I, I subscribe to you. With you. I subscribe to you every month. And I was agreeing with you. And you're Dewey. actually paying me right now while you're sitting here talking about not paying me. <laughs> <laughs> Just saying, you don't know where the money is. So it's, how are you getting paid? It's somewhere. <laughs> I really should look at this, but I've been worried, more worried about my class, man. The class is done as of tomorrow. I'm done with paper, and I can start looking into it. See, the class is promise of future money. This is promise of current money, dude. I'd still gladly take the class over. What? You, what? <laughs> oh boy, second play line. Um, do we don't map map it to. <sighs> Into crack map for second temple. Yeah. Well, the question is whether, whether or not we're supposed to grab a blast zone to take up a take out the Urza. Nah. Because we can still cast. Um, I like the blast zone. Because we can still cast uh, the. Nah, I, like, I like just killing them. We can still cast the smash, is what I'm saying. Can we <laughs> yes! We have the literal mana! It's right here. One, two, four. I know how to count. Tron players always skipping numbers. You're just lucky it's not one, two, seven. No, they're lucky it's not one, two. Ooh. <laughs> not good. That one seems real good. They're going to make it six, six. They have two six, sixes, do we? We have a three, two. I'm going to block. I think we block. I think you're right. 
Yeah. Super real. Real good. Real good. Hey, we can cast this ley line now. I don't want to alarm you. <laughs> yeah, we really need a bless. Jeez, why don't we play engineer skills? We could play for zero right now. Yeah. And wipe them out. Aw, oh, yeah. The subscription. Just to prove you guys wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Show me the money, Dewey. Show me the money. Oh, uh, it's somewhere. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't want to alarm you, Dewey, but Thank why don't we play Ratchet Bomb anymore? That seems really good right here. Yeah, that does seem real good. Because this is the one deck it's good against. We need Karn to find us a... Uh, in Staring Bridge. In Staring Bridge, like, now. Like, this turn that we didn't. No, we can still, we're still alive this turn. We can take one hit. Block the construct. To see what we find. Look at that card, Santa Verza. Good card. See, cards are just father praise me. Cards are just good. You know. I agree. Like, if you've ever questioned yourself if cards a good card, you just look at cards and you're like, oh, that's a good card. Is Silver good golem, good card. I mean, liberated, good card. Let's compare. Cyan, let's compare Karn. To all the other. Why is he ticking Karn up? That makes no sense. I don't know. But we're going to give him the Spire, I believe. What is the other card? Bobble. Bobble. No, no, give him the Spire. Give him the land. Who cares? You know, look at the amount uh, the quality has of Karns compared to all the other Planeswalkers. We've gotten three. One. We have four Karns. Do we have four? Uh, Planeswalkers. You didn't say that. No. Okay, let's, we can even consider that. Uh, Karn, uh, original, uh, one of the best EDH generals. Uh, yeah. He's actually really good. He's really good. He's good. What is it? Karn. Karn's on top? Oh, woo! I hate you guys, so I hate you both. We still mm -hmm. can't go Karn no, we into, just to, uh... die if we play Karn. Correct. We're done. No, we're not dead yet. No, we're dead because we, if we go Karn, we can't die. Uh... Yeah. Okay. Okay. This isn't looking good, folks. You want to check your Hotly rate? One of the quality of those Hotlys? Like every other... Planeswalker. There's always at least one bad. Karn? Not Teferi. None. Hmm? Oh, yeah. yeah. Teferi. Every Teferi The recruited. dual deck Teferi is terrible. No, yeah. it isn't. It's, it's, it's terrible. It's an EDH staple. The one that, no. the one that untaps no. an artifact. No, it's terrible. It's minus is draw two cards. It's ultimate is take two turns. No. I think we have to run out Smasher here. It's, it's terrible. You just, you just try to trigger me. <laughs> Did you know what the sad thing is, Blake? It's horribly. It's horribly. <laughs> we can't run out Karn, otherwise it just dies. We really should have played the second uh, ley line of the wood. Huh? We should have just played the second ley line of the wood. To die? Yeah. Yeah, I, I would quite easily disregard the Planeswalker deck cards. I don't even know why. I mean... You were bringing up cards that exist. It exists. I know. I'm it's just trying to give you. Guys, I'm trying to give you guys leverage on the conversation here. Actually, I'm the, it. actually, if you want to be, if you want to judge like planeswalkers, the Hwatli from the planeswalker deck is actually better than the one from the set. So they just put the exact same two cards again. Yeah. In the same order. That's yeah. That's crazy. Hmm. Well, that's not good. I don't want to alarm you, do we? I have burn. not seen this card. I used to sideboard my, that. Yeah, everybody used to when when uh, Boggles was dominating with Boggles, Splinter Twin. Yeah, yeah, you would always you'd side it, you. Yeah. What do you hit? <laughs> sure. Yeah, we're dead. No. 
or not? How big are those? Five fives. We're taking that. I'm pretty sure it's the correct move because what we want to do is play Karn, get in Snare Bridge. Yeah, and you can block the. And then I can block down the Riddlesmith to leave Karn. Ooh, sweet. Check this on zero. That's not bad. They do have a play, though. If they find Echo of Eons, they can make you draw cards. <laughs> Does that matter? Yeah. What is making us draw cards? Did they mean? find the Echo? With the echo? Because if you ensnare and bridge, it uh, <laughs> matters how many cards are in your hand. Like. I forgot what we were talking about. <laughs> That's their out. If they don't find Echo of Eons, they lose. I was scared for this guy. I was like, where's my ensnare and bridge? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're not. You know, I used to play with the masterpieces. Draw steps looking good. Boy. We got a chalice on zero, we got a snaring bridge, we got a car. Uh, well, what? they can't mill themselves to try to hit the echo. Uh, we're dead. <laughs> Dude, I don't want to alarm you. <laughs> we're dead. <laughs> I was so happy for a second. I was like, we just need one turn. We just needed one turn. <laughs> Your deck much cooler than hers. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Ray of Revelation, dude. And Ancient Grudge. Man, when was the last time you saw that card? Sheesh. Quality magic. Ray of Revelation, that card's sweet. <laughs> At least you can say one thing. You can now tell people that you got blown up by a ray of revelation. You're not How many wrong. people can say that? You're not wrong. Uh, chalice on up. one. This hand looks pretty bad. Ugh. Hand looks pretty good. Ugh. Should was it have... really 2012 since Ray Revelation has been seeing relevant play? Yeah. Gosh. Oh, what? Yeah. Shouldn't we just Merfolk. fish? Merfolk! It's just fish. Is it just fish? Though? Yeah. Yeah. It was like the only deck that plays that. Yeah. If, you, if it, it was just Mutaball, it could have done quite a few things. The weird fairies deck. It's fairy ninjas. <laughs> <laughs> You're not wrong. There is the outside chance that it's fairy ninjas. No, fairy ninjas don't play that. So I just have to definitely just like, oh, we can't. Yeah, it's fish. This could we can't still play be fairy blast. Ninjas. No. Well, still, I mean, it, it, it could still be. could be fairy ninjas. You're right. It could be. <laughs> don't want to alarm you. It could be gabos on the blue in uh, the island in Tomato Vault. It could be gabos. Karn should be an honorary, uh, Eldrazi. What? He should just be an honorary, honorary Eldrazi so we can play it off the temple. Merfolk. Mer 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 still could be... Sweet. Still could be Fairy Ninjas, just splashing a Merfolk card. Pretty sweet. What does this card even do? Adapt. It adapts. Still yeah. Adapt, it I always forget that we're in the future. Mm. There you go. Looking less and less like fairy ninjas. Blast on We just blast on one. Could be merfolk ninjas. Right, dude? We just blast on one. I think so. Take another one. Oh, we two. definitely do now. Then he activated it. Yeah, we can blast on one and, and then lord use the other one for blast on two. He is a lord of Atlantis. Uh, I think we just. Bla like, blow the blast on one. Yeah. The vial is just the important thing. Let's 
pass here. I don't, I'd rather block. Mm. A lot of lords. lords. Yeah, yeah, they are. Not real. If we assemble Tron, we get to Karn, Bridge, and end the game. This number's not bad. That's pretty bad. Smasher. Hold up this member, pass it over. We'll melt that dismember. I'm hoping. There's a guy that's actually, uh... Who's the, what's the team that they're on? They have the purple color. They used Nova. To be, they used to be on the game on team. Nova. Oh. Is it Nova now? I think Nova's the purple okay. team. Yeah, there's, there's a, a player there that's actually uh, well known for playing fish still. And of course there's Nikachu who still plays fish. The streamer. Yeah. His hand's got to be great because he hasn't played in a land. Or trash. <laughs> if they have another lord here, we're kind of in trouble. He's, they're just Not debating really. if they want to play another creature from their hand or just swing it. They, act, they oh, summon the lord, strike. they swing, we dismember, block, kill two things, and die. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. So this would another lord would kill us. Another lord in Leia would kill us. No, because we'd go down to eight. And then the two unblocked would still be four fours. So. It, we're going to end up taking seven. These are all the same, right? Yeah. We're going to take. We so take just a total of the mutable. Vault. No. No, it's a four four. It's going to be a four it's four regardless. And the others will become three threes. I'd rather kill okay. them. Okay. Yeah, you'd rather take six it's and less, two. It's less damage. Well, the difference between being a two and one is. I, I guess it cuts them off lane too, so. Is that correct? Okay. We dismember. What's up, Fizz? Thanks for crushing us. That deck was sweet, man. Tron. Tron. That's all. That's what saves us. Did we get it? Ah, the boat. Oh wait, we can play the boat. It says it gives us three life, right? No, no, it just kills something. Oh, I thought it was lightning helix. Damn. Yeah. So we're dead, right? Yeah, we're dead. Wait, you can buff. No, we can't. Blast one doesn't save us. Karn into a one drop. That was a point. Karn can't get anything. I still have, yeah. I just want to play the boat. <laughs> okay. I like the boat. Maybe they'll get psyched out and not realize that they can swing. Yeah. Even if it's a work in progress, but that deck is, was all, seemed like a lot of fun. It was cooler than our deck. You don't like our deck? I, if we had Urza in our deck, I would be liking our deck, too. <laughs> oh, man. They saw the line. No, I can't believe they saw that. Block with the boat. Block with the boat. It's too late. Block with the boat. Here. Uh, you know, that was actually a surprisingly pretty close game, though. All right, so we need both of these. That's about it. And we don't need this Ulamog. Don't need the boat. What? We definitely need the boat. Chalice is very good in this matchup. Yeah, we don't have much to take out. We'll probably take out one, but... Do we want to bring another boat? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, uh, probably boat. the collar as well, honestly. Yeah, collar. Boated. Is there anything else we can take out to replace the Chalice? Um... 
We could bring in an ensnaring bridge, but I, feel I like, like that. I like, I like, no, I like Trinister. Like, we could bring Trinister, though. No, it's not that great against them. Alright, I believe you. Yeah, I think I'm good with the, if we randomly draw the one of Chalice on the play. I mean, on the draw. I mean, on, on like on our you know, right away in our opening hand. That's cool. Was it Noah who was talking about putting a map inside? Noah talks about a lot of crazy stuff, and I don't feel like map inside's correct. No. You want to increase your chance of having a turn one. What was his reasoning? Like fetch to Fetching fetch it out. it out to get like a blast zone or something. Yeah, I feel like that's the most roundabout way of getting your card. I agree. Like, decreasing your odds of hitting Tron to increase your odds of hitting a utility land in a very roundabout way does not seem correct. I agree. However, me and him did talk about uh, a chalice in the side. I mean, it's extremely relevant, but not relevant on turn two. So, like, you need a chalice on two or three or four? Yeah. Sounds great. No, no, um, like... Chalice on zero against um, like summoner's pack decks. Mm. It's Put like, it on zero. Like uh, if you chalice uh, yeah. Amiel on zero, but it's you don't really need that good. On, you don't need that on turn one. You know. It's fair. This card's dope. Yeah, card's really good. That goes quarter sweet. That Ember here is going to be doing a lot of work. Well, the question is if okay they help. Here's a bad spreading season, they don't. Uh, I think we just. Can we just play Embringer next turn? Possibly. Embringer and kill the. Uh, Can't kill anyone. Embringer is six mana, right? Six mana, right? Oh, you're talking about using this. Embringer and then this. Yeah. yeah. Guys, we got the Herbar. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we can have one Herbar show up like every cast, game. We can cast Dismember. Later on, if we wanted to, without paying life, guys. Actually, that's pretty sweet. Might be relevant. <laughs> <laughs> In this matchup? But for now. Seems, but for now. We're yeah. counting this. It's not irrelevant. It's, it's there. It can happen, guys. This blast zone is going to. Chaos. This is the turn where they finally drew their uh, ley line. Ley line. You mean vile? Vile. Uh, he's he's gonna hold up the. Uh, oh, that seems pretty good. Thing, so. Hmm. What's gonna do? Again, having a ratchet bomb here would be really nice. How many cards does he have in hand? Four. Four. We, we have can chalice on two. We could. We could chalice on two. I'm cool. That with seems that. really good. Yeah. I like they that. don't have a vial, so that seems good here. Yeah, I like Jellison too. Did you just repeat what we said again? <laughs> yes, I, actually did. Said it, I actually said it when you guys said it initially, but I'm like, I was repeating it again to myself. I feel like he's just repeating what I said again to look smart. <laughs> you know, like, I feel like you repeat what I said. <laughs> okay. This guy. This guy. What is uh, Embringer's natural tap? Pink. Pink. Is there a way they could punish me here? I don't think you attack. Why? Uh, because you can shoot down that Biomancer right now because he can't. Because they can kill our Karn. He we can't adapt kill our Karn. Yeah, it's a 2 2, dude. I. Oh, the, they can swing bad. back and kill our Karn, though. My bad. It's untapping. Dude. It untaps every turn. You guys aren't used to magic cards. <laughs> we don't play bad ones. <laughs> <laughs> you literally played this deck, didn't you? No, he played Bear Eldrazi. Oh, they played a different six drop, the bad one. <laughs> he, his, uh, we man. both have had a lot of fun with the Drawn Revolt, and you know it. <laughs> yeah! I tried to play it in 2019! It was fun, wasn't it? Yeah. It was pre Hogak, so it, was, it wasn't that bad. Does he have a lord? So if he was willing to swing, I'd wipe his I don't way. think you want to ping the. Uh, oh yeah, now you can. Why he's already a two-two? No, no. I was saying I no. I was saying that if he left his mana untapped, I don't think Dewey wants to ping his opponent because if he taps the Emberger, then uh, his opponent get Harbinger. 
bounce the ember before it untaps. Doesn't Harbinger cost two? Uh, it costs two, but it, if you want to give it flash, it costs uh -huh. two colorless more. But it costs two, right? Mm, yes, it, the it does. <laughs> Joust the wood. Good card. <laughs> Who knew? Do the heads up, boys. So we just, just lock him out, right? No, because he can still kill it. Uh, why don't we no. just all his dust him? Can he? Yeah, he just wins with both creatures. Why don't we just play a land, all his dust him, and then draw a card with the Ember Nerf? You grab transfer. Oh, force a negation, you say? He pitched it mm -hmm. too. Trickster, trickster. I think we just um, take a card. I don't think there's anything we want. Transfer. Yeah, we, we would be giving up our card, though. So you want to yeah. just I think we just take up cards. Yeah. We draw a card with the Edinburgh. Now. Now well. It's like if they have another trickster to stop our thing from untapping. They can. Trickster costs two. And this untaps on. Uh, so it untaps with the opt untap step anyway. Uh. Okay, at this point, I'm willing to do this. See what he has. What do you mean? What are we holding on for? Hercule, uh, okay, Hercules Recall. Okay, yeah. <laughs> you can't play two drops. Yeah, I forgot. Ciao. Good, <laughs> card. Good card. As you just reminded me. <laughs> That's my bad. What was, I, like, what was I saying? Either one of us played Joust in the Wind. Never. I did. Ever. I did. You played it in... You played it in Affinity. Yeah. I did. That's <laughs> now, that is now becoming a, a uh, staple of Affinity. No. It, one deck saw play... Does uh, not make a statement. No, it's a lot of the decks are playing it right now that are top. Show me. Okay. <laughs> I will. <laughs> okay. One deck posts a result with a weird card. That weird card is now a staple, apparently. No, there are three decks within that, after that weekend, three decks top eight with it. <laughs> I was, I, and I was shocked. I was like, this card's terrible. Why are people playing it? I like my signal pests. What are you keeping this for? What? This has dope. It doesn't. What does it do? Yeah, yeah, dude. I, I even I'm confused. It has blast zone, which is really relevant in this matchup. It has this member, which is really relevant, taking out their dudes. The uh, Bass's collar will allow for us to keep things off the board. It's good with Enbringer. Yeah, and also Ballista, and also Smasher. I'm cool with this. He's gonna name our map. That's fine. Is it though? Yeah, we have a dismember. Is it though? Is it though? Just because you guys say that doesn't actually mean anything. Well, right? we're squinting too when we say it. Doesn't yeah. it though? Stop really? pretending to be Thor. <laughs> Alright, I think we just want to pass here. <laughs> we just play collar here? No, because then our, uh, our blast will take it out. Does it fall? <laughs> <laughs> you two are terrible. You're the one that gave us an open invitation. <laughs> I play garbage real. decks, you know this. It's gonna be revoked real soon. <laughs> Shut up. Blake, you're ruining everything. <laughs> I just want to point out, Dewey, we got you a subscriber today. Hmm? We got you a subscriber. Actually, that was you single-handedly for hating on Dewey. Mm, yes. I single-handedly made you five bucks. So I now owe Did you... Did you, though? 185. <laughs> so my so tally yeah, is now at so. 185, I correct? So. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yeah, it's 185 now. That <laughs> just don't vape again. It's going to be like, go back to 195. <laughs> 
What did he just? He just echoed you. But... <laughs> okay. So we still sweet. We can crack the map right now. Or we so like. Or we run out the temple. I think we just run out the temple. We at this point we may want to let Lasso get up to two. So maybe it's worth it to just go temple, uh, play matter reshaper, play the collar. Yep. In. Cousin, are you though? I am though. You know who's a hater though? Dorby. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. I didn't like that play. I would have played the ghost corner. Did you though? Would you though? <laughs> Why? Unbeatable. I mean, we can't play both. We can't play like. We, we can't play the color. No, no, we can't play. We can't activate it. Like matter reshaper costs three. Then it's fine. How's it? Is it <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! The poor are taking an abnormally long time to make a decision. It's fish. There's a lot of play lines. There is. Play fish. <laughs> play line over. Is that the only line? No. You're right. They have a robot they can play too. Is that <laughs> Where's the looter scooter? Uh, that died when fairies died. I think they still play it. Do they play the looter scooter? Yeah. Really? <laughs> Well, it's still a loop. I mean, that... It's a 3-3 three, three that Do loops. they, though? I think it's a 3-3 that Link loops. was about to play one this weekend. Yeah. Hell yeah, he was. Thank God. I not play that deck. Uh, you know, anybody's... Anytime anybody says, hey, you go play in the looter scooter. Come in. Is that a good draw, though? Mm, not really. Why not? It's like a great draw. Is it? Yeah. I would like to introduce you to Basilisk Collar. Walking Ballista. I just don't know. I just don't see it. Is it good enough, though? I'm going to stab you good. How much does it cost to equip that Basilisk Collar? Two. Two. To quote Blake, hater. Yeah. Gorby, should, it's fine. <laughs> we should equip that Basilisk Collar. No. Apparently, I, I dropped wanna, the salt along with I want to take off Blasso. Two. That's unreasonable. We could blow it on one. They got their vial. I mean, they could revoke her in right here. So. Well, they could also revoke her, like our blast zone or our collar. Will they, though? That's not fun. I hate you guys. <coughs> Suck in my head. Now. <laughs> Is it Do fun? you, though? <laughs> 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 So they got one revoker in hand of three unknowns. So this blast one is gonna do work. Take a five though. Are we though doing it? Yeah. See? They might flash in our lord, but you saw them. They know. didn't do that. No, they're gonna flash in the uh Phyrexian revoker and then blast it. <laughs> probably. Now that we spent mana on it, probably. Yeah. Make us some good. Oh, you lost the Hey, we can cast Dismember. Have we not found that in one of our games yet? <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Just curious. Don't know if I want to do anything but pass. I think you just need to pass. Does Bricks or Revoker read as it enters play? Is it like a Middle Mage thing? Yeah. It's exactly like Middle Mage thing. That's unfortunate. Man. He's Echoing Truths. I think I want to crack this one. What is Echoing Truth? So I guess we can pass. Mm, yeah. I mean, if we had to activate the Vile, I definitely would.
take the three or no? Mm-hmm. I mean two. I think it's two. It's fine. Because I want. I think I'd like to be able to play the Endbringer. Yeah, I think you should just let it go. Just get Endbringer and play. Uh, Maybe flash the board. Man, these swamp creatures are gonna kill us. Swamp, 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 swamp. Swampity swamp. Sure, what do you want to name? As a lord, we're still not dead, right? Yeah. What if you place two lords? Then you he can't activate dead. mutable bolts. Because he'd have to tap. Can I see three? No, he, he, he can't, he'd have to use he Vile, could. one in, and then tap and cast one. But that means he can only activate one mutable bolt. Yeah. Which means we're not dead. Okay. If he could put two Is lords in. Is that true, it, though? Almost that be I wasn't going there. Here you go. Really, boy? I just want to point out this is being recorded for all future generations to yeah. see. Yeah. Is it, though? <laughs> I just want to point out if I had a car, I probably wouldn't be here right now. Oh, really? Did you get dropped off? I did. Where is she at? At home. Oh, okay. I invited her to stay. Okay, so I think I want to. Mm. Just shoot the uh, revoker. Yeah. Seems pretty strong. And then you just quit the collar. I don't know. I don't think fish can beat that. I mean, they can bounce it. I think you just play the. Uh, Do we play the dot dot now too? Yeah, I think so. Maybe you should do that first. Probably. But here we are. Should we have a... That's delicious right there. <laughs> so do we just like take, take the, the vial and just not care about the other cards? Yeah, I'm going to take the force. No, Why? Take... We're just never going to play any other non-creature spell. What if I want to? But we're not going to. <laughs> vial literally doesn't do anything. If we get another blast zone, we blow up both of them. Which is the more reason to take the force? Alright. <laughs> <laughs> you guys walk yourself out of logic and don't agree with yourself. Do we though? Yes! I bet they're really mad about Hopeless Force. Because <laughs> we don't care. They can hard cast it, though. Sure, they can. It hit all of our non creature spells. Oh, our chalice, man. Our chalice. You think they're gonna be like really excited to shoot that? Like just to counter and just that. We gain the like ah. Our chalice becomes a thought seize. Mm-hmm. I think we just draw a card here. What? I feel like we just no. I think we attack we attack. No, we definitely just attack them. Yeah, no, you attack with a thought knot. I'm swinging with thought knot. Yeah, attack with thought knot. It's knot. a two turn clock. If I swing with Thought Knot, they can, if they, uh, would Double itself, you can they, shoot can, one. they can activate both and block our Thought Knot. Well, you should have played a Walking Blister first. No. Should we have, though? Yeah. Just, we have Ghost Quarter. Yeah. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> You're right. <laughs> just. You're right. Just point that one out there. Another drawn piece? No. No, Temple. Andrew, don't be silly. You're right. I know. This 
is still a two turn block. It makes her feel better. Yep, that's the record. That's the record. Let's see quality magic. It's magic, all right. We're winning. I don't know about quality. Quality. This is far from quality. Quality. Chat, is this quality magic? Chat, this is quality magic, right? Chat, can we get a blah blah in chat? Because <laughs> that's what that walking blitz is going to be doing to him. Blah blah! No? Yeah. We're going to attack, they're going to try and block it, and walking blitz. What? No, they're conceding. Blah blah. Oh, because they saw the walking blitz in her hand because they're uh, ghosting, right? Oh. Chat, they were ghosting us. Chat was not ghosting us. I mean, chat was ghosting us. Chat was watching us the whole time. Nah. Oh, what our opponent. Oh my god, we still have three more matches. You said this would be fast. Match them blue white. <laughs> I don't know about that. I'm pretty sure we've got game match one. Game nah, two. Nah, nah, I don't close. think so. Really, Mike? Are you it's sure? only taking a bit longer because we stuck around for watching our opponent go off. Oh my god, this hand's great. All gas. That's a hand of magic cards. I feel like we have to keep this. That's unfortunate. Nah, let's go for it. Done. Keep You're it. welcome. You're welcome. Wow. Let's live the dream. <laughs> live the dream. Hit a thought knot. <laughs> thought knot. Come on, baby. One. Keep triple tower. We got double temple. It's better. Oh! I feel like we're going to lose. They kept seven. <laughs> uh, this card literally doesn't do anything. Why did we play with them? I don't want to play them. I have them. For when I want to install and bridge, you can have to play, I suppose. Okay, so they saw some old tech. No, that's pretty relevant right now. Yeah, almost. A lot of lesser running two. I'm not, but a lot of lesser running two to three. So they're so they're wrong. Got it. Five. Corey <sighs> smashed upside the head. Do I don't want to alarm you. This is fine. The third clock's a little bit faster. This than is fine. Clock. Just a little bit. This is fine. Should have put that chalice in five. You heard what I said. Do we have finally had no first shot? One of one of uh, Dewey's opponents at the invitation will put a chalice on eight. Yep, and I proceeded to host him like the board. His opponent was like, the only way I lose is if you play Ulabog and Dewey goes, I'm gonna crack this O stone that's been in play. <laughs> yeah, the one that's actually in play. He's like, oh yeah, forgot about that one. <laughs> that's sixteen mana. Hit infinite mana. Oh, they have their own card. You should have probably cracked the map. Oh, no, this game's over. Yeah, we're, they we're, have we're a Tron. I'm just trying to see what they're fetching up. Because we're conceding this game. I mean, we have a ghost card. Yeah. But they also have, like, a smash. Mm -hmm. No, we're done. We tried, Chet. Sorry. Oh, we didn't try hard enough. Dewey didn't miracle hard enough. Dewey didn't crack the map in response to the, the card. I think they're literally Dewey. conceding. Take those out, huh? So what do you bring in? Uh, not much, because my board has been thoroughly wrecked. Let's see, this is why the card package, not good. It's fine. I think we're playing this liquid metal. But we'll bring this in. Gosh. <laughs> what do you bring in? The liquid, liquid metal. metal. I have nothing else to bring in. <laughs> I think I'd rather keep a Chalice in over the Liquid Metal. The Chalice doesn't do anything. Chalice on two, they play Mindstorms. Chalice doesn't do anything. Better than Liquid Metal, which is literally nothing. <laughs> hey, if I have a card and I cast it, I can just start. You can also just fetch it out. <laughs> no, no, but I, I can start blowing up lands the same turn. Sure. <laughs> Bull. Reasonable. Bull. Key. 
Oh, I don't mean to alarm you, dude, but we're going to have a turn three Enberger. <laughs> no, we're not. We're turn four Enberger. No, we're going to draw another temple yeah. after that Enberger. Yeah. Oh my gosh. And you guys think I'm unreasonable. No, I'm being unreasonable. No. You know, I always tap it that way, hoping that MTG will just take the mana. But it never does. <laughs> <laughs> they're, they do the same side work thing because they have nothing. They're going to name Enberger. Yep. That or depending on their hand, they can name Kern. But I would imagine it's Enberger. If we rip another side. We the bolt in, right? Yeah. Yeah. God, I should play the other land. Yeah, sure, but. Get that clock in. That's a thought knot if I've ever seen one. Yeah, so like gonna both take games they've gone Temple into Tron. Yeah. Without cracking a map. Yeah. They're just gonna take the Ember. I don't see why they wouldn't. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They might take the contortion, I guess. I wouldn't. It helps Dewey trade in combat. That's fair, but that... Okay, sure. The Endbringer is a 6-6. Six, six. That's pretty good. Cool. So, like... I'm just running out this card. Right, we'll I would just mean, play card yeah. and just grab a Liquid Metal Coating. And we're going to see if that's enough. that evil on us. <laughs> Why do you keep rooting for the opponent every time? No, they're just going to play a card of their own. Their liquid medic clothing is going to look pretty silly. Are they put no, it's just a smasher. Yeah, it's a smasher. That's a... I think we just double it's block the thought knot. Bit awkward, folks. Why? We trade two creatures for one. Yeah, we also need to draw three cards. And our Karn dies. Their the Karn's the dying, dying either way. No matter what. We're drawing three cards. I'd rather draw three. Is it, though? Yes. Is, the, is it even going after the card? Check. <laughs> yes. <laughs> but just like, I, I mean, I would have confirmed. What? No. You're right. It makes a cost to us after you play it. Right. Why would you play the trunk? Uh, cause... I or are you gonna play an Embringer? You go Embringer to Liquid Metal? Yeah. Okay. I said Embringer, right? I didn't say yet. We're good. I have this recording. I don't believe you do. <laughs> <laughs> do you, though? This Ugin is going to be so sweet, though. Is it? It's not really. That I mean, it's not not really. The two twos are sweet. They're two twos. They're wrong. They clog Against the board. a five five will trample? They clog the board. It's, it's relevant. Sure. Playing their own Endbringer? Nope, that's nope. another smasher. smasher. Okay. So we're just gonna like trade. Yeah, we're definitely trading. Because we can't activate this stupid thing. <clears throat> Unfortunately, we can't M Ugin into the reality smasher. Mm. So awkward. So we play Ugin? Still, yeah. Just yeah, we just play Ugin and Bluff. 
He, our opponent's gotta fight over Ugin. Come with under the, the, the spirit? Dismember. Like, dismember! <laughs> so good. Is it though? Good. You know what we haven't hit this game? Herbor. <laughs> That's what we're losing. <laughs> we haven't dropped the <laughs> It's coming. <laughs> Just in the nick of time. Is it though? No, definitely just discard it. <laughs> he is definitely just gonna crack the map, go to complete Tron. Yeah, we're just checking if he has anything to kill us with. If he doesn't, we get another turn. Oh, Karn. This guy is so good. He definitely wanted it more than us. I'm just doing it because I'm well aware that doesn't work that way. He apparently thinks it might, though. <laughs> Wait, what? I, I turned his tower into an artifact. Yeah. <laughs> it doesn't do anything. <laughs> Pretty the mana. I made him click it. <laughs> uh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> So if he fetches out a uh, lattice, we attack the Karn. No, we have to block. No, we attack the Karn if our opponent gives us the dismember. We can kill their smasher, play our smasher. Yeah, it just depends on how what they do with the attack here and what they fetch up. <sighs> how many cards do we have in our deck? Mid four, mid forty-five, mid forty-six. Can't come. That's Ruben. Gonna shut down our Ugin. Yeah, seems pretty good. Probably attack the Ugin. Means they can just start attacking us. If they do that, we just play our Smasher, kill Connor. In the end. Gonna make it in. Static abilities are a hell of a thing. Everything at con? I like Blast Zone 2. Getting it up to 2. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's interesting. I mean, that's the correct block. Yeah. So Karn lives. Yes, yes, they can. But if they do that, then Ugin gets to stick around and then their Karn dies. Does it though? How many reality smash do they play? Two. Two. Sweet. Oh, nice. Also a line. Oh, I see what he's doing. Okay. What? He wants to trade off the spyglass for Enberger. What? He wants to trade off the spyglass so his Enberger gets its abilities. Yeah. Little does he know we have a dismember and he just killed the yeah. Enberger. Yeah. So we're just going to attack Karn. I think he's just doing this to attack Ugin.
And we're putting blocks on up to two? Yeah. If we could. No. Crack it out one, send a message. I'd rather get the land. That's fair. Or real short on the Andrew. <laughs> you know, but Ugin costs reducing everything. And I don't know, I just sent a message. That's prime. <clears throat> I think we just attack Karn. Attack Karn. Dismember their spyglass. Why are we dismembering the spyglass? So they can activate their ember. We're nice people, do we? Okay. Blast back up to two, and then we'll just probably kill it again. He was in here. Of course. And then kill it. But if he does if that, he does that. We get Ugin. Yeah. If he doesn't do that, we're just killing his um, liquid metal anyway. Liquid metal anyway. Yes. So, there's that. It's the correct line, though. It's just, oh, I say, I feel like it's He's the probably correct. got another car in hand. Yeah. If he does, then it's probably good. He's good. 10, it's 10, a 10 lot. 11 mana. So you can play a new car and then. That's the last, last, so expecting Karn. Okay, so everything we play costs two less now. Even our dismembers. Just... Okay. Have the Karn. He doesn't know how the lock works. Maybe he was just doing it to because he figured his Karn was gonna die. What? So if we find a Karn they lose? So put the I'm really confused why he would do this. How how high can you get blast on? Uh one, two, three, four. Probably okay. probably just better do that two here. Yeah. Symbolotron, Bonham, Surgical, or Carnage. Oh. Okay. Man, that Surgical looks weird as an artifact. It is. Colorless, not an artifact. No, he's saying it looks weird. I know, he said it looks weird as an artifact. It's not mm -hmm. an artifact, it's colorless. It makes all spells, right? All cards that aren't on the battlefield colorless, but it makes all permanents on the battlefield artifacts. So he doesn't yeah. have the, the card, but he's making say that we won't ever have it. Yeah. Okay. Also, well, pretty good. Uh, that's only two. Oh yeah. Well, we can just walk the blast on right now. No, the blast zone doesn't do anything right we, now. If we can put it to six. Yes, that's the thing. Well, he has one turn to draw us. Put it to six. If he doesn't draw the Karn. Even if he does draw a Karn. No, if he draws a Karn, we just lose. Yeah, we just lose, because he can plus a lattice. Yeah. That's a ballsy move. So I would have rather just plussed up. Yeah. Plussed up. So I'm at... Uh, who can put it to one? Uh, it was plus up, took out the blast zone. Oh, oh, the liquid metal blast zone? Yeah. yeah, I feel like there's just better lines there. Because then he gives us one turn with Ugin, but then next turn, uh, Karn's at three, and we down tick down to get Lattice and stuck around at one. Have another creature. Yeah, we kill it, but. Hmm? We kill it. Yeah. Still kill the Karn, but we also don't have the blast zone anymore. 
Yeah, just that was really weird, really awkward. Line. He gave himself one draw. That's where Uget. You see how good Uget is, man. Too good. So good. This hand is terrible. So good. It gets shipped right away. This kind of hand is fine. It's real iffy. That's fine. Our turn is going to be the exact same thing. Except I'm playing Temple. Why are you playing Temple instead? Because there's a thought not in here. Because if I rip a Temple... Mm -hmm. Huh? I don't play the deck. I don't know. It wouldn't be correct if he had another drawn piece. If he had another... Okay. Correct. correct. I'm just thinking, like, I'm not on the line, like, when do you draw another drawn piece? You know what I mean? Or you can do that. That's why we do that. Okay. Yeah. What are they grabbing our temple? Probably. Yeah, I'm not sure if I agree. I really don't. I don't know why you would search really for I really don't agree with that. That's absolutely incorrect. Yeah, because then... If you're going to be fetching up... But well, we don't know what he drew for turn. Yeah, he didn't know either until... Oh. Yeah. <laughs> Dude, it's late. I'm getting tired. Nice. Mm -hmm. I like just playing collar and putting it on. Yep. Collar, suit up. Savage. Yeah, you don't just rip it, do you? Just rip. No, I. All my plays are like statistically correct odds. Is he just playing ballistic? That's why yeah. you don't take the ballsy moves. I did do the ballsy move. We did the temple in turn one. But no, that's the statistically correct move. Yeah. Is this the ballsy ball move is playing the tower, hoping to draw one of the other two pieces. That's the ballsy move. I don't think so. I think temp uh, thought on turn two is actually a really big deal here. Yeah. Yeah. But that's not the ballsy move. No, it's the ballsy move, because it's like... I can't yeah, believe he just naturally drew Tron, but... Well, that's crazy. Tap for eight. What's he doing? He doesn't know. He's like, I got all this mana. But what do I do? <laughs> he can Karn and Snaring Bridge, but we can still swing if he does that. Hmm... Mm -hmm. No. Yep. Yes, because he has five cards in hand. So he gets card. The last card down to four. We get snare bridge cast yeah. it. Yeah. He's down to four in hand. We knew that was coming. So what's your follow up, big boy? Save the card. See what what does plusing do though? It puts it attack it, it, it does like have one. Nothing. Minusing doesn't do anything either, that's the thing. Minusing gets a card in his hand. Yeah, it gets a card in his hand. It's yeah. gonna grab the bridge or the liquid metal. Which is better than Yeah, it's better. Yeah, it's better. Does he have a creature in the side? Does he have the filigree? What? Filigree Familiar. Enters back for the game to life. Dies Docker. Nice. That'd be sweet. Oh, I put that artifact combo. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He does go with the Instagram bridge. Okay. Yeah. So unless he drew a one drop. Probably cast it too. Do we got a ballista on our side still? Yeah. No oh no, we were in right then. No, we cut it before the league started. Oh yeah, that's right. We're just plaguing our 
What's the question? Do we play Karn or do we go with map? How many cards does he have in deck? We're playing Karn. Yeah. Because we can still crack the temples and form Tron and cast less. That's true, yeah. Plus the on the map. Oh, because he's got the. Oh, I didn't. Yeah. That's just bad. You just didn't do anything with it, dude. Yeah. That was just me just clicking through it. Too bad. Stop, he has a smasher of Karn guys. I know. Looks like you got it. I mean, he can't attack, but, you know. To an emperor, whatever. He can't attack. Whatever. Can't yeah, he can't, can't do anything with it. Can't attack. You didn't realize that either. Do it. Uh, what are you talking about, Blake? He can't, of course he can't attack. Ensnaring Bridge. God. Learn these things, Corby. Ever. Card mirrors are These weird, are like man. the longest games ever I've seen with this deck. Card mirrors are weird. All of them are taking so long. <clears throat> I want to point out it's not because of us. Oh, weird. Is that your ride? Yeah, we probably last turn should have fetched out liquid. My hand used my ride. Uh, okay. Am I though? Yeah. <gasps> the boat. Yeah, we're not playing the boat. Do we just play Lattice here? Yeah, I Twitch. would like to win. Yeah. Lattice. Sweet card. Makes it fun and interesting game for magic. Here's the problem. Uh, I don't think our opponent's going to concede. Why? They're dead. Mm -hmm. They literally have more car or less cards in their deck than we do. They, for some reason, think they're still in this game. So. Okay. Plus, they can't attack because of bridge. <laughs> hey, if you guys need a dip, you guys are more than you guys aren't required to stay. I'm good. He works in the morning, doesn't he? Yeah, I do. I took the day off. He works at like 6 in the morning. I took the day off. I don't know. His problem. <laughs> you need a dip, Blake. No, we're fine. <laughs> Dude, you're not dead tomorrow. I know. Let's see if we can make these last two super quick. Hopefully it's not a uh, drum. If they beer. play a hollow phone, we're going to dip. <laughs> 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 what if they have bad spirits? Doesn't matter. <laughs> of course, we're gonna play against Bands Groups. The best deck in the format. It's a <clears throat> mediocre hand. Sure. If Blake, it won an IQ. Man, these hands are bad. These hands are real bad. So bad. <laughs> Not see what they're on first, at least. Oh, I was supposed to go, yeah. Oh, God. No. Oh good, it's whole gag. They just need to confirm for the week and see. <laughs> you just bastard. Yeah, we're conceding. Fuck. It, it might be jump. Whole gag doesn't play Thossy. <laughs> we're gonna take a gamble. That's like John. Yeah, it should be John. Lay that in the void Zach and it's John though. Bring in the contortions, we're gonna take out the chalices. Bring in the boat, take out the chalice. Sure. Bring in the collar, take out the chalice. I got two boats and that's it. <laughs> can sweet. Yeah, it can be. If I get into the temple. You know, it's still a matter of shaper. Definitely good. Definitely good. Of course, what matter of shaper? <laughs> God, boy. They might take Ballista. They might, if they have a confidant in him. Mm. 
It's fine. Temple at the top. <laughs> reward. Never not a reward. If that's really this bad in this match. <laughs> this is like the best one, the one of we've ever had. This, that's the worst in this matchup, though. Who's? <laughs> that's a really rude opponent. Temple off the top. Temple off the top. Blah, blah. Confirmed John. Confirmed John the minute they played thought season the next turn or next year Inquisition. Oh, oh my god. god. Professional <laughs> double thought nuts here. <laughs> Script him. What does he get? Double Lily. Uh, yeah, take both lilies. Thank you. Even though I can't play those lilies. I think I have a bird oh, over here. Bird. Okay. I didn't know what I mean. Oh my goodness, that was sick. Good thing we play the herb. I think I have to get an assassin trophy. No, they have a blood bird in hand. Please don't all rip like a pulse or something. Sure. Two yeah. damage. Discard a card? Yeah. <laughs> Darn it, Urborn. No! <laughs> <laughs> oh, the big problem is that's a 5 6 now. It's fine. We win the race if they start attacking us. Oh, that's sweet. Make it so they can't attack or block with it. <laughs> Kind of weird. Yeah, there's no school in front of right there. Right? Yeah. Oh, that's, that's a beautiful card. Good card. Good card. Did they can see me right now? Yeah. Dude, you are so good at this game. <laughs> Professional. Just when you think that we need to start, you know, pricing the draw step more, Miracle. You know? Dude, he's just like... Whatever, natural tribe. No big deal. Take up my temple. No big deal. <laughs> Boom. Great hand. I mean, it's not great, but we're going to keep it. I was lying. It's terrible. Do we want to I think you put it in the average hand. We're just going to rip another crown piece out. Now the hand looks pretty average. That all is best looks sweet. Until it makes it go for seven, eight. Relevant. Wow. They really? really don't like the black man. They know we have the herb board. That's what it is. Oh my. <laughs> Dude, how do we get so good at this game? <laughs> If they don't grab another black source, I'm gonna be real bit. Yeah. Well, no, not our waste. If only we had this, like, all this dust in our name. How big is the coin? Three. I mean, if we had a smasher, I'd say smash, but don't. Oh, that Liliana is a problem. So. Yeah, I'll gladly take a two for one. All this dust card. Darn it. There goes the matter of shaper. I'm just happy it's not a thought seize, okay? I mean, we still be fine if they had a thought seize. Huh. Like, either one of our th threats are good. Yeah. So 
of thought not into it. Okay. Thought not into Ember? You can't. Oh, it's six, yeah. Karn could get Snaring Branch. That's about it. Seems like a solid choice, though. No. Okay. Gives me one turn to have an answer. I used to think the most important lands in Eldrazi Tron were the temples. They are usually. I'm mistaken. It's got a pulse. Pelican's command. That too. Buy that glyph. Actually, we might want to take a blood braid elf. Yeah. Because they can blood braid into a. Mm -hmm. Oh, I know they can. No, they didn't have another. They, no, they, they didn't have another land. land. Yeah. Just, that's fine. Wincon enabled. What? Couldn't see. He knew it was over. Yeah. Once the bachelor's collar equips it's open. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Sure. Dude, you are way too good at drawing Tron. That's why I play Tron. It's absurd. That's why we play Tron. Like, mm. maybe we need to get on this Tron train. No. <laughs> I value my life. Yeah, honestly, the biggest thing is you have to actually be okay with people just not liking you. Dude, everyone likes you. Even when you run, then people like you. <laughs> I think you still have to be okay. Like, a lot of people actually get pretty mad about it. He's gonna hate me. He's gonna hate me. Can you yeah. that? Fish again. Fish? What? So with this fish meta. Black and blister. Good draw. As long as they don't have a spreading seeds, we're good. Probably should have let off with the power pillar. Nah. So I don't lead off with the one I have duplicate of anymore. Um, so the, the reason being is if they feel those corners and fuel runs into surgicals, if you lead off with the one you have, you're gonna get punished. So what you're saying is when I'm playing against you always get the second one. You play. <laughs> mm -hmm. I actually do mind games too. It's my sequence. I think we, mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. We'll grab Aquiline Shrew because we can take care of all the lords. Yeah, yeah we can put Walking Bullets on five next turn. Mm -hmm. We're just going to Blast Zone. Yeah, we're going to grab Blast Zone. But we're also going to Blast on five. That's two lords, boys. 
four four uh you hope. That's cool. It's a five five mule vault. Oh wait. Because he's gonna drop. Four, four. No, he's gonna drop the other lord here in a second. He's just trying to bait us into the train. And I think I'm gonna take it. You at least block the lord. Yeah, I'm gonna block the lord here. We'll trade with the lord. Mm -hmm. Didn't see this one. Did you see that one coming out? Of the Just one time. <sighs> well then. I didn't use a mutable vault for that. Oh, I know, that's a cycling line, isn't it? Mm -hmm. That's sweet to play that. Makes sense. I, the other one is really, playing the blue green one. It's this and this one enters tap. I, I disagree. I think he's playing the. So they're looking for something to survive the ballista? Yeah. Trying to take away our ballista's ability. Yeah, because what so what he's trying to do is gonna tap the ballista, put a counter on it, or uh, you know, take its ability away, and on the following turn, in his upkeep, he's gonna uh, use the harbinger to bounce it. Oh, I didn't yeah. I think I'm okay with just doing this, take out a lord. Yeah. I should have tapped differently. I messed up with the first two ta taps. Yeah, because then you could get the blast on it too. Yeah, I thought you just thought not right now. I actually think it's fine if they harbinger. No, it, I'm okay with them being harbinger. I just could have took a card out yeah. of their hand. That's why I'm annoyed with Blast the Elf. Yeah. Sorry, we shoot the Lord. I'm not sure if that's correct. If not, we go to three. Yeah, that's a pretty big deal. We have two mutable bolts. Okay. Mm -hmm. We just stick both our creatures with the glass on. So. Mm -hmm. I kind of don't mind blowing up the blast zone because they're not, they don't have much. I think you blow up the blast zone because Harbinger's double, uh, double blue. Double blue's a big deal. They both are. Yeah, take out the trickster. Taps out a creature. Well, he can't. He doesn't. He needs to have double blue for it. 
If he double blues and turns and returns us back to our hand, he can only activate one Mutal Volt. We block one and take two and go to three. What if he has a dismember? If he has a dismember? We go to one. We go to one. We have to put a clock on him. That's fair. Second time we're playing fish with this deck? Yeah. yeah. Is fish coming back? Point. We need to get on this fish train. Uh. So, Ulamog comes out. Yep. What else did we take out last time? I think we shaved on the chalices. Yeah. I think we actually cut them all. No, we cut no. all but one. Yeah, we okay. saved one. That makes sense, because I, I wanted to bring in the other collar, so... Yep. And, then we, uh, and then we ended up searching for one of the car and to lock him out. Yeah. One of the chalices? <laughs> yep. Yeah, we did. Yeah, that was pretty sweet. What's up, Amp? Thanks for joining, man. We are just wrapping up the stream for the night. We got a sleepy Gorby next to me. And I have a so, final paper I haven't been writing. You didn't introduce me, that's rude. And I have an Andrew in the background. Yeah, or oh, really? Oh man, Blake's too sleepy for me to do the really. Tired, man. Really? He's gonna get home just pass right now. Uh, I guess. I don't think his hand's good enough. This hand's great, cute. You know, bad games take longer. Right? Perfect. Is it though? It's pretty close. Like we're leading on tempo. That's really good. No lie, no lie. Easy. Fish play boomerang sometimes. Boomerang! Blake, I know you love some Boomerang's boomerang. Hot. <laughs> Blake, did you ever play boomerang? I did. It was hot garbage. Did you do well with boomerang? That de deck was hot garbage. You had a lot of fun playing that deck, though. I did. I would mind. Super fun. I, I went like 0-4. That Monday night following that. Remember, I didn't have a deck, and you just said, uh, Here, Andrew, have fun. Oh, okay. <coughs> Our opponent is so good! <laughs> they just sent the deck! That's a little unfortunate. Did it too? They just we saw it coming. We had it. Because it wants a loot. I don't think so. And you got your boat. I'm so happy. I love my boat. Oh man. What they show? Harbinger. I don't know why fish should constantly show that card specifically. Better adept. Yeah, like I. Oh my goodness. Just all the temples. I think we played tower here, don't we? Yeah. Yep. Let's see if I smash her. And next turn, we play the temple and all of this. If we played the. Temple, we could have held up the dismember. dismember. Yeah. Were you just trying to bait out as many cards as possible? That's rude, opponent. That's rude. They yeah, actually have to discard a card, though, right? Use that? No. No. It's only if a spell targets it, not an ability. Alright. Seems like a good three for one. Hope they don't have a force. That would be unfortunate.
points were you? Definitely up there tapping me on this. Countered. Ooh, are they going to go for the draw to see if they can rip a horse? Oh no, they're just bouncing. We're okay with that. And then the boat kills whoever they play next. Exactly. Man, the boat is so good. Oh, and your oh, temple, we got her your temple, temple back. back. <laughs> yeah. We killed the that. spreading seas. Mm -hmm. well, I forgot about that. You guys do not play enough Tron. Fuck no. I got a boat, and Go! <laughs> mm, I'm going to save that. Yeah, I would too. That one. That one did. In the next room, play a reality smasher and the boat kills something else? Yes, that's what we're going to do. Or we just. Uh, I think we just all is dust. We're going to all is dust for a three for one again. No cards in your opponent? Cards are dead? Zero? Oh. It would have been real hot if we had drew a. Uh, Trial baby? A mine. Yeah. We're gonna play the game called How Many Smashes Can We Play? <laughs> Please, God, let us draw mine. So we're gonna animate this boat. Oh my God. Can the boat hit people? No, but it can hit creatures. That's a boat. All right, folks, and it's 4 1 with that list. That was pretty good. Urborg didn't make as much of an impact, but we kept trying it. Professionals. All right, folks, we're going to have a good night. I uh, will be here next week, Sunday, but the following Sunday I will not be because I am going to Magic Fest Detroit. So thank you so much, everybody, for joining. Have a wonderful night, and I'll see you all next week, Sunday.